for nostalgia. Oh, gosh. Uh, you, you recognize this, right? <laughs> Unfortunately. The guy who took that photograph tells me it's worth lots and lots of money now, and I'm curious what you would pay me for this one so you could tear it up and get rid of it. Well, I guess it, from what I hear, I'm going to have to pay for a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> um, now that we have a bit of nostalgic mood, and now that the show is, on, in contrast, left into the 21st century, I mean, we're on Facebook and Twitter, we may need to update our clever little animation a bit, or perhaps not. Yeah, I change a good thing. It's not actually an email, see? Dennis Fixon posted this on the Facebook page. Been a huge JG fan since the night I saw him lap the field on the half mile I think Belleville, Kansas, on his 19th birthday. He's never looked back. Uh, come August 4th, it'll be 20 years since uh, that runaway birthday win in Belleville Midget Nationals. That is my favorite email because it reminds me how fortunate I was to be reporting on this open wheel rising star who started to make his way in the stock car world. Give a listen ah, to this. Ah, look at us. But yeah, I've been really busy, uh, you know, running the stock cars down south today at Charlotte. Ran here in Indianapolis at the fairgrounds last night and had a really good win there. And uh, we're going to try to do it again here tonight. So, Jeff, does anything jump out at you as you look at that freeze frame? We look a lot different. <laughs> See, I'm noticing the fact that you've got the Diet Pepsi driver uniform and the Budweiser hat. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I'm, there, I'm, wondering, I'm wondering about that. Hey, whatever it took to get in that race car, uh, I don't know. That's, that's, a, <laughs> well, that's a great call because I know I wasn't 21. Somebody must have been paying attention because what happens next is we go to a little video but highlighting your Budweiser shootout that our, uh, uh, Bud, night before the 500, I think, sponsored. So you're thinking it might have been a sponsor hat. I'm well, a little curious my, about it. It wasn't my sponsor, but it was a sponsor of the race sponsor hat. I'm, I'm curious about that, because look what happens. We come back from this feature, where we're back on camera, <laughs> and the Budweiser hat that was No, that was just the beginning of the hat change. You know, that, that, oh, I see. <laughs> that's the sponsors looking, looking out for things. I have no idea. He's but, also got the Diet Pepsi. There. We pay yeah, attention and, to and this And by the way, I'm, I'm, I'm going to critique myself. I, you can't even see Diet Pepsi on the can, so <laughs> I noticed that, that would never happen today. Fast forward 20 years. What happened?